Up next, Theresa with Gilmo. Overall, in the free healing, the pitcher looks very nice. At times, the dog gets vocal whenever you say foos. Slightly bunchy downfield, slightly wide in both about turns. And in the group, it could be just slightly quicker to the basic position. It's a good exercise. The set of motion when the foos command is given is vocal. It should be calmer in the basic. When you give the sit command, you can sit much faster and all the way into the sit position. It's a little very good. Then with recall, vocal when the foos command is given. Down is very fast. Dog comes with good speed, the front is good, and the finish is correct. It's a very good exercise. The standing while running, again, the dog is slightly vocal in the beginning. Everything else is without fault, high, very good. Tree dumbbell over the flat, and the basic will be slightly calmer. Where he comes, he goes out with good speed, comes back with good speed. In the front, he slightly bumps, and we need to, when we do the dumbbell, not tuck underneath our arm, but it's a high, good exercise. Retrieve over the hurdle, and the basics will be shown just slightly better. Dog goes out and back with good speed. In the front, he slightly bumps and is slightly crooked. It's a very good exercise. Retrieve over the wall. The dog goes out and comes back with very good speed. In the front, ever so slightly bumps and slightly crooked at this time. And at this point, he should be a little quicker to the basic position when given the command. It's a very good exercise. The send out, the dog should go much further. Excuse me, the dog should go uh, slightly straighter. And with more purpose as he runs down the field and when the down command is given he can be slightly faster. Slight vocalization in the sit position. Satisfactory exercise with long down under distraction. He's just slightly restless. It's a very good exercise today, 88 points. Next up we have catalog number 50, Teresa Carrier with Gilmo.
the helper dog is very fast tight to the blind and di easily directable excellent exercise hold and bark ever so slight chin bumps in the guarding but very strong and convincing guarding when you call your dog out he comes very quickly but he should be slightly closer to you high good the escape the obedience in the very beginning, he's restless at the sit. The foos and sit and down are in order. He's very quick to the helper, comes up with a full calm and hard grip, demonstrates, demonstrates a clean out. And again, we see this dominating, intense, very nice um, guarding, very good exercise. On the attack out of the scape, dog strikes into the helper, has a full calm and hard grip, should be just slightly calmer before the out. And then we had some extra outs, insufficient. Back transport, overall excellent. Attack out of the back transport, dog is very fast into the helper, has a full, calm, and hard grip throughout. Demonstrates a quick and clean out. And we see here very strong guarding, ever so slight chin bump, high, very good. On the long bite, your obedience to the basic position is correct. Basic position, the dog is calm. Dog comes quickly down the field, comes up with a full grip, and is calm and hard throughout. Takes two outs to out the dog satisfactory. On the attack out of the long bite, dog strikes into the helper, has a full, calm, and hard grip. His first out takes, uh, takes three outs overall to out the dog. He does out and not rebite toward the end. And the transport's in order and except at the very end, the dog needs to sit all the way down. Today, 74 pronounced. Show your game.